hope I can find a friend in the forest today. There must be a wind coming up. Gee, it's getting stronger and stronger. Wow, it must be a storm coming. For goodness sake, it's a giant who's <sighs> causing all the wind with his sighing. Whoop, a ghost. His hollering has caused a landslide. Don't be scared. Oh, I'm not scared. It's just that I got snow down my neck. Jeepers. I'm Casper, the friendly ghost. My name's Hugo. I, I was sighing because I'm, I'm lonesome. I've got some wonderful animal friends who can cure your loneliness. Well, that sounds just dandy. I'll go ahead and tell them you're coming. Hi, friends. I've got a surprise for you. We're going to have a guest. Uh, who? 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 There he is now. A giant. But he's very friendly. Couldn't he stay here for a while? Oh, yes, uh, why not? All of a sudden, I'm tired. Uh, uh, do you have a house uh, big enough for me to sleep in? Uh, no. I know, Hugo. You can sleep in that big cave. Thanks, fellas. Well, it's time we went to sleep, too. We'll never sleep with all that racket going on. Let's turn him on his side. Easy does it. He's quiet now. I guess we won't get much rest tonight. He twitches in his sleep. I don't know if it was such a good idea bringing him here, Casper. Oh, what a night. Couldn't sleep a wink all night. Yeah, that giant kept a twitching and a snoring. Uh, now for my morning exercises. One, two, three, four, five. There goes six, my house. Eight. Now I'm hungry. You wait here, Hugo. We'll bring you some food. Thank you, Casper. We'll have to get a lot of fruit and berries to feed him. I guess so. <laughs> You had enough breakfast, Hugo? Oh, well, I always eat a light breakfast. Uh, uh, but lunch and dinner, that's when I really eat. Casper, you wear us out fetching food for him. We'll run out of food for ourselves. We can't sleep. And besides, he might step on us. Casper, get rid of that giant. <laughs> you don't like me. <laughs> Help! It's a flood! Casper, do something. Stop him from bawling. Gosh, I'll have to do something or I'll lose all my friends. Please, Hugo, stop crying. They weren't talking about you. They weren't? Well, I thought they were. No. Gee, I feel so glad. Uh, let me fix your house, Mr. Rabbit. There, it's all fixed. Help! Help! The lumberjacks are coming! Oh, no! How awful! They'll cut down all the trees! That sounds bad. Real bad. Which one should we start with? Look! A giant! You were expecting maybe Tom Thumb? Yeah! I did good, huh, Casper? Uh, uh, tell me I did real good. You did good. Real, real good. Just the way a giant should. We, we love, love you so! Junior! You come home this very instant. That's my mama calling me. Uh, uh, goodbye now. i uh, uh, coming, mama! You shouldn't have run off from giant land like that, you naughty boy. Gee, I'm sorry, Mama. Nice boy, that, Hugo. But I guess you're all kind of glad he's gone. Casper! <laughs> 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 Hugo! Hugo!
Bingo was the nicest person you ever brought us. <laughs> oh, well, I guess you just can't please all of the people all of the time.
wish, Casper, then blow out the candles. He always says hello, and he's really glad to meet you, wherever he may go. He's kind to every living creature, grown-ups don't understand, but you love him the most. But kids all know that he loves them so, that's where the friendly go.
out of here. Over here, buddy. Uh, uh oh, Mr. Repairman. Please don't stare at the merchandise. Why? What did I do? It's faces like yours that stop clocks, buddy. Well, none of us is perfect. You can say that again. What can I do for you? Well, I'd like a new crystal for my watch. Yeah, that's a weirdo. Let me take a look at it. Mm. Mm hmm. Uh huh. So what's the matter? What are you doing? You need a new watch. Why? All that's broken is the crystal. It's old style, outdated, passe. Nobody wears all the numbers anymore. Why, this watch isn't even shockproof. Here, I'll show you. Listen, this watch was given to me by my grandfather. It's an heirloom. <laughs> Okay, I'll fix the crystal. But I'm telling you for your own good, get a new watch. I could give you one with just four numbers on it. I don't need one. When will it be ready? In a few short weeks. So long? So long. What do you mean you give me a watch with just four numbers on it? Just four numbers. Twelve, three, six, and nine. Hey, you got one with eight numbers on it? We got four numbers and ten numbers. What's the one with ten numbers? The 12 and 6 are left out. How much is that? 50 bucks. 50 bucks? What do you think I am, a millionaire? <laughs> what have you got in the clock? How much money you got? $30. I've got just the thing for you, a nice cuckoo clock. But all I got is $30. That's all right, the cuckoo's dead. Oh, that's too bad. We got a sparrow in its place. But a sparrow don't make no noise. I'm a heavy sleeper. It'll take more than a sparrow to wake me up. How would you like it if I put an eagle on top of the clock? An eagle? A baby eagle. But who's gonna feed him? You are. Listen, buddy, the eagle alone sells for 30 bucks ordinarily. But for me? You could have the whole thing, the clock and the eagle, for 40 bucks. But I only got $30. I'll trust you. You got my watch. That's why I'll trust you. Okay, but I'm a heavy sleeper. The only thing that really wakes me up in the morning is a cold shower. Now, how's a baby eagle gonna do that? It's simple. The eagle will swoop down, pick you up bodily, fly you into the bathroom, drop you in the tub, and turn on the shower. Hey, that's great, just like a siren. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Uh, where's the eagle? Here. Why, he looks like a sparrow. It's a baby eagle. It'll grow bigger. You mean this thing's gonna grow up to lift me out of bed? That's right. In a few short weeks, he'll be a monster. He's got powerful talons. Show him those talons. Ow! Ow! Uh, all right, I'm convinced. Uh, I'll see you in a few short weeks. You'll never regret it. to welcome back a satisfied customer. I want my watch back. Why? The eagle's too weak. He keeps picking me up and dropping me. Look, I'm a mess. He just hasn't got the strength to make it. Maybe you're not feeding him right. Too many starches. I want my watch back. Wait a minute. I've got just a thing for you. A special eagle food, packed with vitamins, guaranteed to transform him into a virtual Hercules. That'll be a buck thirty-five. Well, I'd like to test it first. That's your privilege, friend. There you are. Ah! Okay, Eagle. Now, let's see you pick up the man. No! No, no! Hey! hey. Ah! <laughs> I still 
say this clock's a goodbye. Goodbye?